Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome Chairman of the Board, Volkswagen Group, Professor Dr. Martin Winterkorn. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. I'm certain that all of you were looking forward to this year's 2015 Frankfurt Motor Show just as much as I was. Looking forward to fascinating cars, new technology and engineering, and meeting a lot of people and having lots of discussions. But here in Frankfurt, it's about more than that, too. In view of the major transitions going on in society and technology, people are asking us for new answers, new solutions, and they're asking us to adopt new paths. In the last 60 minutes, we've seen that we in the Volkswagen Group have adopted these new paths. We are working on these new solutions, and we are giving people these new answers. Let's take, for instance, electric mobility, the Porsche Mission E and the Audi e-tron Quattro are, to put it simply, quantum leaps in our industry. More than 500 kilometers of range with that much performance and a car that's so fun to drive. This is incredible customer benefit. The Tiguan GTE represents how we are now systematically bringing plug-in hybrids into more classes and more segments. And with V-Charge, Volkswagen has presented to you the future of charging. And Porsche, too, has turbocharging, which means that they're cutting the Gordian knot of e-mobility with charging times of just 15 minutes. Today, already, our group has the widest electric fleet of the automotive world. But I can announce something to you here in Frankfurt. Before the end of this decade, we will be launching 20 more electric cars and plug-in hybrids, from small cars all the way on up to the next Phaeton and Audi A8, which means 20 new electric models by 2020. I think that that's the clearest possible expression of our commitment to electric mobility. Now, speaking to lawmakers, I'd like to say that we, the right cars are there, but now it's important to have the right fundamentals and conditions to ensure that the, this key technology can become established. And then there's a second major area for the future, digitization. This, too, has long be ago become part of our DNA. And here, too, our new products are a very clear signal. The new Audi A4 and, and Seat Connect range demonstrate that, for us, connectivity and state-of-the-art infotainment have moved into all brands and all classes of vehicles. Our group already has the biggest interconnected fleet of vehicles on the road. And we're going on from there. By the end of this decade, each and every car will become a rolling smartphone. And in doing this, we are paving the way, not least, for one of the most fascinating technologies of our time, automated driving. Audi and Volkswagen are ensuring that customers will be able to benefit from this as soon as possible on motorways, freeways, in stop-and-go traffic, and as you saw, in searching for a parking spot. And our assistance systems are evidence that we are making cars safer than ever before as you would expect from Volkswagen, not just in the luxury class, but for everyone. And for Volkswagen, pioneering intuitive operating concepts such as gesture control in the Golf or touch are not science fiction. Very soon they'll be a reality in our car, accessible to all with real added value for people, for our customers. Ladies and gentlemen, Highly efficient diesel and 
spark ignition engines, the entire range of alternative powertrains, connectivity and automated driving, big data, smart mobility services and car sharing, new materials and ever more efficient production processes. Automation with a sense of proportion in factory 4.0 with advanced manufacturing. Our data labs in Munich and San Francisco and soon in Berlin, Wolfsburg and Beijing. And and our huge global digitization initiative in sales, which means that our more than 2,000 sales outlets in Germany are becoming one of the most modern networks in the entire industry. So I can't remember any time when we were working at one and the same time concurrently on so many promising different new possibilities. So you can see we are moving toward new horizons at Volkswagen, but we're also in the process of reinventing Europe's biggest automotive group in terms of technology, in terms of economics, and in terms of our structures. And now we're seeing that it's paying off, that we came up with future tracks. We were the first in making change in the world of automobiles the number one issue. Here in Frankfurt, you can see the first concrete results of future tracks. And this, ladies and gentlemen, is just the beginning. Of course, I know that all of you are nowadays looking at the new players in automotive, on the automotive playing field, as it were. We're doing that too. But the fact that the big IT companies are interested in cars shows us first and foremost, that our core product is highly attractive. And you know us. We at Volkswagen love a great competition for the best solution. And I can also say that Volkswagen will remain in the driver's seat. Mobility, with all its facets, will remain our core domain and our core passion, even in the digital age. And last but not least, one important point for me. Even though many people claim the contrary, I can say that people's passion for cars has not declined a single bit. But people's passion for cars is changing. Of course, a Bentley, Bentayga, a Bugatti, a Lamborghini, and a Porsche 911 will always have room in the automotive industry and in people's hearts. But even at the top of the automotive world, we see that faster, higher, farther all the time is no longer sufficient. Technology leadership is not just defined on the basis of horsepower and torque. Fun with economical zero emissions driving, enjoying interconnection with your car, allowing you to take part in digital life, the wonderful opportunities offered by automated driving. This, ladies and gentlemen, will be the currency of the years to come. This is where the future of our industry and of the automobile will be decided. And therefore, we are working on all of these new subjects with the same intensity and with the same passion that we have always shown in working on perfect panel gaps and the best internal combustion engines. Let me put it this way. We are putting precision, intrinsic value, and quality of our cars into the new digital world. And I personally cannot imagine any job that would be more exciting than that. And I'm more convinced than ever before that our brands not only sell cars and technology, they stand for our attitude, our feeling toward life, for real, lasting values. And this, for our team and for me, is an obligation and an incentive. And this, ladies and gentlemen, is what makes all the difference. Thank you for your attention. I hope you all have a wonderful and successful Frankfurt Motor Show in 2015.